Hi, in this video, I am going to show how to use Mongoose IoT firmware to implement remote device control. First, we need a hardware module. I am going to take ESP8266 mode MCU and connect it to my laptop via the USB cable. Second, we need the MIOT tool, which can be downloaded from the mongooseiot.com website. Go to Downloads and get the version you need. Export several environment variables for the MIOT tool. MIOT underscore port is a serial device your hardware module is connected to. Clone Mongoose IoT GitHub repo and go to the FW slash examples slash C underscore HTTP directory. Open SRC slash main dot C file. We see that the code registers a simple HTTP request handler attached to the slash CTL URI. The handler looks at either HTTP body or the query string and expects to parse a JSON object with two keys, a pin and a state. If successful, it sets a given GPIO pin to a given state. Let's build it. Type MIOT build and press enter and flash it. Type MIOT flash and press enter. Now configure Wi-Fi on it and attach a serial console to see device logs Type MIOT console and press enter. We can see the device's IP address in the log. Let's start another terminal and send a command to the device. GPIO number 2 is a built in blue LED on Node MCU. It is now turned on. Let's now turn it off. Hope you enjoyed this video. In the next videos, I am going to show you how to control devices using MQTT protocol, how to perform over the air update, and more. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to get updated.